Hi guys! Today we will use the Cricut Joy to make a cute little project. So let's unbox it together and see what's in the box. So the first thing you will notice is that it's a very tiny machine. This means crafting on the go. It's lightweight, it's small, it's great for those small projects when you don't feel like taking out the big machines. It also cuts up to 20 feet of material at one go. And best of all, you can cut without a mat. However, you will need smart material for that. So let's see what comes inside. notice when you open up your machine is that it has no buttons so this means it's controlled by the design space directly so no cricket button start button load unload button also there is only the power cord slot so no USB connections when you open up the machine it has only one slot for the blade it changes the same way it does in all the other machines first remove the packaging material. There's also a little sticker here. So the blade changes the same way it does in all the other machines. You just push the plunger, pull the blade, replace, back. It's magnetic. The pen also goes in the same slot as the blade, so it doesn't have two slots, it just has the one. To insert the pen, all you need to do, remove the blade, drop the pen, don't push, just drop, not like the other machines, and close, and you're good to go. Also note that the pens and the blades are not interchangeable with the other Cricut machines. Now let's see what came in the welcome pack. Let's open this up. You have the let's get started card. It shows you step by step what to do to get started. You have some smart material. This is permanent vinyl and you get a mat which is the four and a half, I believe, four and a half inches, and your warranty cards, and some more material for your first project. So let's get on and start the project that I'm going to do, which is going to be a simple vinyl sign for my kitten Luca's teepee bed. It came with a sign board, and I thought I would personalize it with vinyl instead of the chalk that it came with it. I'll insert a photo here so you know what I'm talking about. So for this project, you will need a blank item, whatever you want to personalize, your choice of vinyl, and we are going to be using the gold permanent vinyl and some Cricut tools to help weed the vinyl. So let's get started. So in design space, I will write my kitten's name, which is Luca with a K. Um, the size I want is six inches wide. And don't forget to change, if you have another machine set up, I have the maker, change it to whatever machine you're going to cut on. Click make it. Now it will ask you if you want without a mat, on a mat, on a card mat. I'm cutting a smart material, so without a mat. Click done and let's click continue. Now I've already set up my Bluetooth with the Cricut Joy. So you just follow the instructions on how to set up a Bluetooth on your laptop or computer. Click the Joy. 
So now we choose the material. I'm choosing Smart Vinyl Permanent. I'm going to leave the pressure at default. And because the Cricut Joy does not have any buttons, it's going to directly, you just have to load the material into the machine and then the go button is going to go green and we're going to press that once we load the machine. Let's check the machine and we'll be back. Okay, so let's load the material into the machine. Also note that the machine actually tells you how much material you're going to need. So I'm going to need seven inches of smart material. So it tells me already how much to cut. And now that we loaded the material into the machine, the go button is highlighted, we click go. Now the cut is complete, we will just click on unload. And let's start weeding this. Okay, so we have our final cut. Now we're going to weed this. Now, because my design was only on this side, don't throw this, so don't just weed it all that way. I'm going to cut it and you can save this as a scrap and you can use it on a mat. So let's cut that bit. Keep this aside. And let's start weeding. There we go. This is the sign that I'm going to put the name on. We give it a spray with an alcohol just to remove any oils. Wipe it. And we get some transfer tape. Scrape it down. Both sides. So here's the final result. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you fell in love with the Cricut Joy as much as I did. So until the next video, goodbye and stay crafty.